Next, let's go ahead and take a look at some of your discussion settings. You are going to spend a lot of time in the discussions area, so you may as well have it look the way that you want. The default view is to have the discussion topics at the top and a preview area at the bottom. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the settings icon in the upper right hand corner and look at some of the things that you are able to do with it. First of all, you can turn on the show discussion topics list. If you check that box and click save, then you're going to see a full discussion list on your left. You'll be able to quickly get to any of the discussions that are available to you and you'll be able to see easily if there are messages that you have not read. Okay, so if we go back to settings, let's go ahead and turn that one off for now. Let's say we don't want to see the preview pane. If we turn that off, now we're not going to see the preview pane down at the bottom. We'll just be able to see all of the messages that are in the discussion. If I click on one, it's just simply going to open up in a new window instead of being in the preview pane down below. Okay, I'm going to go back to the settings that I had. So I'm going to turn the preview pane back on. And let's change this from grid style to reading style and see what that looks like. Okay, grid style shows everything in kind of a hierarchy, but reading style allows us to see all of the messages as they appear all on one page. So we're able to quickly read everything and decide what we want to reply to. Now when we get there, the only difference is if I reply to that message, it's not going to automatically mark that it has been read, which it will do when we're in grid style. So if I have to, I would just go ahead and mark that as read after I have read the message. That's just a way for you to keep track of what messages you have and have not read. Okay, so let's go back to settings again. This time we will go back to grid style. And instead of threaded view, we're going to go to unthreaded view. Threaded view really just means that you are able to very quickly and easily see which are the original posts and which are the replies because the replies are always going to be indented. In unthreaded view, you don't see all of those things. Now, the reason you may want to use unthreaded view is because then it opens up more options for you to be able to uh, sort by date and by author, by subject. Not all of those sorting options are available to you in the threaded view. Okay, so let's go back to our settings again and we'll change it back to threaded view and let's go ahead and save and now we're back to the default view okay so that's up to you how you want that to look but just know that you have several of those options available to you